give me some hitters that could be dealt at some point. Yeah, I'll give you five hitters that I believe will be traded between now and the deadline. And it starts with the Chicago Cubs catcher, Wilson Contreras, who is going to be a free agent. He is the most talented catcher right now on the trade market. You've got both New York teams that should have interest. The Mets do have interest. The Yankees are hesitant because of the good job right now that Trevino and Higashioka is doing. But there's a lot of teams that need an upgrade at that position. And Contreras you know, is not just a catcher, he's a bat. He can also DH as well. So that's going to be an interesting name. Josh Bell and Nelson Cruz, both of the Washington Nationals. Uh, both of them I, I expect to be traded. At, uh, they're both going to be free agents. Uh, no reason they should hold on to them for the last couple months of the season. So they're going to go. Watch Trey Mancini in Baltimore. I'm being told that they're already planning a year from now uh, to have life after Mancini. So I, I think he's the most likely of all the guys on the list to go. And if Mitch Haneker can ever get healthy, he's a free agent at the end of the year. If Seattle doesn't start winning uh, and Haneker can, can get healthy, which I expect him to by then, um, that's another big name that could get traded for a lot of teams looking for a corner outfielder. On the flip side, what about those guys most likely not to be traded before August 2nd? Yeah, well, obviously, teams that are in the pennant race aren't going to trade their impending free agent bats, right? Aaron Judge is the biggest bat. There's no way the Yankees are, are not going to be in the playoff hunt, so he's obviously not going to get dealt. Trey Turner's not going anywhere with the Dodgers. The two that are interesting on this list, though, are Carlos Correa and Xander Bogarts. Uh, if Minnesota all of a sudden were to tank and the White Sox will over, overtake them, perhaps he could get traded. Again, unlikely. Uh, Xander Bogarts, uh, same, same thing. Yeah, he's a free agent at the end of the year. He's going to opt out. If the Red Sox can't extend him by August 2nd and they're not in the race, they could deal him. But look, I expect all these guys on the board to be in pennant races. I don't think any of them will get traded. But we at least need to pay attention to the names because they are all free agents uh, come November. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.